there is a, a special announcement that we made. I think it's two weeks ago, if I'm not mistaken, where I announced that we are working hard to build our studio because we've been operating on skeletal equipment. But we want to renew our equipment and uh, our database of videos is now full. The storage devices are now full. So when we made that announcement, we got an overwhelming response from the saints in different parts of the world. So it will be remiss. It will be a, a, a scene before God for me not to acknowledge the labor of love that has been demonstrated by saints, especially in South Africa. The saints in South Africa, they've responded very seriously to our campaign to purchase the video mixer and also our campaign to purchase other equipment like uh, laptops for broadcasting purposes uh, as well as a second camera because right now we are primarily using one good camera but uh, we need a camera which will produce high quality work for, for God not only in terms of the sermons that we are doing but also in terms of the other announcement that I want to make. So I just want to take this opportunity to, to say uh, we are continuing with the campaign uh, through the details that I'm going to give you. But I want to take this opportunity to pray for those who have contributed their heart and income to empower us to share the gospel message of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. We know it's a huge sacrifice during these times of COVID-19 for you to take your heart and income and uh, purchase for us a video mixer and purchase for us the other equipment that we need uh, to do the work of God. I know the names of the people in South Africa and other countries we have contributed to us. But uh, uh, the Spirit of God does not allow me, and the Word of God as well, to mention people's names because I will be depriving them of their blessing. They chose to do it in secret. The God who sees the good that is done in secret, He will minister a mighty blessing for them. In this ministry, we don't force anyone to give. But uh, whenever there is a need, we pray to God. Uh, at times, God just moves supernaturally on people to give exactly whatever we need for a particular need that we'll be having as a ministry. But uh, at times, God authorizes us uh, to, to make special campaigns. We don't want to have a habit of looking for money from people. We just want to rely on the grace and mercy of God. But uh, there are certain circumstances, extraordinary circumstances, when we feel led by the Spirit of God to, to announce to the prayer partners of this ministry who are always praying for us and the, the material and financial partners of this church or this ministry who are always supporting us financially to do the work of God. So without much wasting of time, I also want to update the partners because there are several partners who contribute to our charitable activities as a minister. Uh, I know I've taken quite a bit of time to appreciate you. Some of our partners, they, they've contributed to our affiliate uh, organization, the Consecrated Work Trust. Uh, you have done well. We just want to appreciate you. I standing here as a a senior pastor and the chairperson or chairman of Divine Kingdom Baptist Ministries. I just want to appreciate you for the contributions that you have been making to Divine Kingdom Baptist Ministries and also to the Consecrated Work Trust. Because uh, as Divine Kingdom Baptist Ministries, our distributions, uh, in most cases we do them through the Consecrated Work Trust. But sometimes we distribute directly. So, we just want to appreciate 
all of this. And uh, so I will release a word of prayer. Father, may you minister a mighty blessing upon the lives of the people who have contributed to the survival of this ministry even during this time of the lockdowns and the pandemic, the COVID-19 pandemic. I speak divine protection upon them and their families. I speak material prosperity in whatever they are engaged in doing. I speak protection and insulation and cover from temptations and anything which is from the pit of hell, from the pit of darkness. I speak healing from sicknesses for those who are not well. I speak marriages for those who are not married, who, re who desire marriage, who require marriage in their lives. Father, I speak open doors and breakthroughs. I speak divine favor and divine acceleration for your people in Jesus' mighty name I have prayed. Amen.